Hey guys, Isabel here. Today I'm going to be talking about kind of a controversial issue on um, store owners keeping all of their promos. So I personally think that is completely not okay that they do that. That I don't stand for that. I don't know how everybody else feels on that, but I think it's just complete bogus. You know, like if that a, a store wouldn't exist if it weren't for the people buying the cards, <laughs> for the people that actually play, for the people that are supporting this business, you know, a small business. It's not like a GameStop. It's not like a giant chain. You know, it's it's a small business. And to pretty much just screw your <laughs> the people that actually help support you out of it, you know, out of something that they play, something that they're passionate about, something that they're giving you their money for, that's pretty messed up. You know, you don't... To keep all of the like art foils and things for yourself, that's so, that's just, it's not okay. <laughs> like a lot of people, I've seen some people that want to like defend the store owners like, oh, well, you know, it is their store, yada, yada, yada. Yeah, well, their store would be out of business if it wasn't for the people coming in and buying and participating in these type of events. Um, I think, uh, I, I think that if... You know, if I saw it going on at the stores that are in my neighborhood or, you know, that are in the places that I live, I I don't know where I would report it, but I mean, I feel like that's something that you should be able to report. That's something that it's it's not okay at all. Um, I don't, again, I don't know what you guys feel on it, so I would love for you guys to just kind of leave me some comments on um, on what you guys think because to to see that happen, that's, that's so messed up. Um, just, there's there's so many other there's other places that I, that you can take your business, and it's at least in the place that I live, and I feel really awful for the people that don't live in the, these type of places, the people that live in small towns and they only have like one or two options to go to as far as stores, and then they're getting ripped off by the guy who owns the place, just keeping all the promos to himself. That's just incredibly selfish. Um, yeah, so those are my thoughts on it, guys. This was just kind of a short video. I wanted to see really what your guys' thoughts are. Uh, I obviously, I just, I don't think that's a cool thing to do at all. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Give this video a thumbs up if you are in agreement that that, that should stop. That if you own a store and you're keeping all the promos, there should be a way that we can just report you. I don't know what kind of reprimands would come with that. You guys get crafty, you know, maybe we can like send them to the shadow realm or something. I don't know. Just spitballing ideas here, guys. So yeah, that's, that's about it for this little like three minute rant. <laughs> um, make sure you guys are subscribed and leave me some comments. I love reading your guys' thoughts. And uh, yeah, be sure to follow our uh, Instagram and our Facebook. Of course, I'll leave everything down in the drop down below. And yeah, I will see you guys on the next video. And I hope this isn't going on at your guys' local card shops either. Bye!